Hello lovelies, it's Lex and I have another speed build for you here today. Uh, this one is a loft build. I don't know if anybody has ever tried to do uh, a loft um, when they haven't made one before, but it can be really tricky to get the placement right uh, so that your bed will work. So this is a way that I have done them in the past um, that seems to work really well, but you do have to be careful about your placement of your bed. Uh, anything that you have underneath the bed that's going to interfere with the routing is what makes the loft beds not work properly. So usually I try to not really have anything underneath the bed uh, but we ended up being able to put like a tv stand and a couple things underneath so just went ahead and put in our floors put in our wall coloring all that good stuff and I was trying to set up how I wanted this to be because I kind of wanted the section of the bed off just so that it would be easier for the sim to be able to get into it so that's just a shelf that's been enlarged with the move objects cheat uh, I was gonna put the desk underneath originally and decided not to because I kind of liked it over in front of the windows uh, that little half wall there is just an easy way to place some you know fake stairs to go up into your loft again those are just shelves that I use as the stairs so with our move objects cheat on we can go ahead and place our bed up into the loft and then periodically I'm gonna have my game go into live mode during the speed build here we go so testing the bed the bed works fine with that TV stand underneath so we're pretty good to go and then I'm just gonna you know go back and forth here constantly testing to make sure that everything works the way it should uh, I know that some people don't test their beds don't test their rooms out I really try to test out all of the rooms that I post to the gallery because I would be so disappointed if I downloaded a room I'm so excited to use it because I love how it looks and then nothing works so about 99% of the time, if I have a room posted, everything in it should be functional. Just so you guys know if you're new and you haven't ever downloaded any one of my things before. But this room is mostly like whites and blues. I did that back wall, that purple color to give it like a little pop of something girly. And then the other walls are just a nice sagey green. So you could really easily go in and change the color of everything in here and use it for a boy if you wanted to. But I guess it's a little more feminine just because of that flower wall. I'm going to put a cute little teddy bear up there just you know a couple little touches little ladybug um, the only thing in this room that was not play tested that I'm not totally sure if it works is that unicorn that's like back behind our fake stairs you could totally move it and it would be you know absolutely fine but I'm not sure if a, a little child sim will be able to get back in there and play with it but I thought it looked really cute there nice little posters I hadn't used those yet I found those in the wall decorations and was like these are too cute so I was excited to test those out lots of different colors and styles of those I like to put those little lights on the trees so that it looks like there's you know like little flowers or whatever but that's kind of it for this corner just some more little decorations and then I'm gonna have our buddy go over and just play test that again it seems really weird since he's like an adult male sim that I have in this like kids bedroom making sure that the bed works but he's just the sim I happen to have on this lot so he works gonna throw in a bookshelf we're gonna do another little lamp a mirror and there's also gonna be a dresser in this room as well uh, but like I said everything in the room was play tested uh, TV works those all of those seating area things work. computer works dresser works mirror works bookshelf works everything seems to work fine uh, except like I said that unicorn I did not play test I hope you enjoy the speedboat guys have a wonderful rest of your day and I will see you next time